Okay, so under configuration, we go to content authoring, scroll to the bottom and choose text formats and editors. Okay, so let's uh, scroll down under name to full HTML and to the right we can click on the configure button. Okay, I've got two uh, groups of uh, buttons here. I've got available buttons and then all the ones we put in our active toolbar. So under available buttons I'll choose styles and I'll click and drag that over which highlights all of the uh, tool settings and so I'll just slide that over to the right in the tools and so I've got styles which now makes the plugin settings uh, entry available under CK editor plugin settings so under styles drop down I'm going to type type in div.testo and then I'll just space one over from uh, that entry put in the vertical bar I'll space over one more and then I'm going to type in yellow background okay with yellow background entered I'll scroll down to the bottom and I'll click save configuration okay so that's now uh, available for uh, content and now to see that I'll go up into my admin menu click on the Drupal 8 icon brings me back to the front page and then I'm gonna click on the tab font test which makes that entry available and I'll click on the edit tab and now we're available to actually interact in the edit tab with the uh, environment we put in and the styles drop downs available so I'm just going to highlight the uh, entry pennon here and then I'll choose under styles that yellow background entry that I made in styles and that uh, basically adds that to the uh, content and I'll just save that content by clicking on the Save button, and that's uh, all there is to it.